Hi, my name is Amrita and we're going to be talking about all the basic elements you require for a newborn photo shoot. So I'm going to start with my handy cart. Now this is basically a cart on wheels that I can keep close to me while I'm working with newborns with all the required elements I need on these three tiers available. So let me break it down to you further. Uh, the first and most important thing for me is baby shisha. So this is basically white noise which a baby apparently hears while it's in the womb. Now you can also use the white noise app on your phone if you wish to. Um, I prefer using this machine. For sanitization and safety purposes, I have my hand sanitizer here. I also have some alcohol swabs which I use to wipe my equipment down with and a couple of masks that I keep handy. For safety purposes, I also have a wrist strap for my camera because if we're doing top angle shots, it becomes a lot safer to have this on hand as a harness. You can choose to even use the neck strap. I prefer the wrist strap because it's not intrusive. On the second tier, I have my favorite posing beans because these really help elevate and secure the baby on the bean bag. So here's how I typically use them. Place them under the blankets and around the baby to secure the baby safely. Now these are extremely useful while you're looking to position the baby for the different newborn poses we're looking to achieve here. On the third tier of the cart, I have some batteries for my trigger, a couple of clips just to clip them around here, and a couple of toys as well in case I'm working with three month olds or six month olds and a bean bag. So this is the handy cart here. Apart from this, I also have a heater, a space heater. The space heater is essentially to keep the entire place around the baby really nice and warm. Typically at around 28 degrees Celsius, just so it's not too warm for the baby, but warm enough to keep them cozy and sleepy. Studies say that babies need to generate a lot of energy to keep themselves warm. So this sort of helps with the process as well. And lastly, I have my beanbag and the beanbag stand, essentially the Paloma shirt stand which you can take a look at here. The sizes are mentioned in the description below and this is the Paloma shell stand which is pretty easy to put together and dismantle and makes it very simple to work with. We don't have to essentially hold it ourselves and also pose the baby in a nice safe manner. The last on my list for the basic setup for a newborn shoot is my light. I currently use the Pro Photo V10 with with the Pro Photo umbrella, the Deep XL version, which is about 64 inches in height, along with the diffuser. And the reason why I like to use the Pro Photo V10 is also because I can use it wirelessly, that is, without any wires running around in the studio, and with the chargeable battery. So, what I have showed you today is my basic setup for a newborn photo shoot before my clients walk in. Now everything I've listed out is of prime importance, but I think top priority requires a lot of safety and sanitization equipment, which must be a part of your setup. Apart from the beanbag setups, we also offer a lot of prop-based setups using a lot of decorative items, wooden props and so on, and we typically keep that ready because they are discussed prior to the client coming in, and those are laid out, and all we have to do is move the baby from one setup to the other, with only a rapid change in between. I hope you found this useful. Please do like, share and subscribe and we'll be back with another video very soon.